So I said this a couple of days ago. I love deck builders. I like deck builder roguelikes, but there are a lot of them. So here's another one. Let's find out if it's good. So this one's actually made by uh, One Shark, who are the people that made Great Hero's Beard. And I just like... Oh gosh, it's not just Great, great Hero's Beard. What? I made a new character and then they took it away from me. Anyway, we're going to be Papa Smurf. Okay, fancy deck builder. Why would someone leave these cards lying around? Better grab a handful. Guess I had four times slash, protection, and two times power to make a nice balance. There we go. Increased attack by 15% for two turns. Well, this will be interesting. Oh, right. I'm going to mute that. Is This game is not putting out any audio. Oh. This would explain why. I was wondering about this. It was just totally silent. Oh, reward codes. All right. And I might turn on fast mode. Eh, I'll keep it off for now. We'll see how it goes. All right, close out of this. Rooms until garden boss. So we got battle, battle, and battle. Battle, battle, and battle. Battle, battle. Let's go. Oh, shit. This fiend wants to devour me. Wait a second. I have six mana in that purple orb. Better pick a card. Use it on myself for an enemy. All right. So it's hitting me for 22. Mana. Ah, see how it works? Monster's glowing sword symbol above its head. I mean, that, uh, I'm sure that means it's about to jump my ass. Wow, this is like weird doof this spire. I'll take it, but it's an odd one. So our protagonist is a smurf. Hell yeah, Papa Smurf. Back from the dead and on a rampage. I'm just gonna turtle. It doesn't seem like this guy gets any tougher. Well, I said it was going to be Slay the Spire-esque. It's pretty Slay the Spire. Yeah, so armor goes away. I get 200 health. I draw five? I draw five cards per turn. I don't know what the question mark is. Probably just whatever's in my library, whatever's in my graveyard. And six energy. Well. And he done. Wow. That's, that's a rainbow right there. Level up. You're a big boy now. What the hell? What is going on? Dropkick. Offensive. 17 damage. 10 damage. All. Draw a card. Or 14 damage and free. I'm gonna go for the free. We're just gonna fight things and just see how this goes. Hey, thank you, Koga Wolf, for the 32-month resub. How are you doing tonight? Uh, let's see. Well, we got two of these bad boys. Free slash. Alright, protection. Wonderful, now my HP turned purple. Gonna name this Absorb. Gotta remember, it only lasts for this turn. I see, I gotta drag it now. To pick target. Yep, free slash was the right, right way to go. I was tempted to go for the one that cost one instead. Reaches into bottomless sock. Score! I found my first magical die. Drop that sucker on myself again. Absorb dice number two. Drop it on these fools. Deal damage equals... Oh. Where that... Where's dice? What? Oh, these. I mean, that's actually really useful. Kill him dead. So, the dice are going to be an interesting and different system. I'm curious about it. Now let's also try and bop power twice, so it lasts for four turns now. Makes sense. I was kind of... Oh, we know my attack's 30% up. So it might stack? I'm not sure. Also, selecting cards is a little fiddly. Well, I unleashed anime with my sword. It's true, I did. Summon a helper that deals 20 damage at the end of each turn. Summon little Jimmy. Hell yeah. And... We can get a weapon. So, four attack, three crit, two attack, three crit, one defense. I'm going to go for this spiked... Oh. No, I'm going to go for the awful board shield. Watch this. Found some items. Mine now. Better open up my fanny pack. I'm in my satchel. I'm in my mustache. All right. So, I got this so far. This is different. Yeah, why is there an anime girl? Man, I don't even... I don't question any of the games these guys make. 
ordinary guy. You come upon an ordinary guy just standing in the middle of the road. He turns around and says, All humans are equal, but some are more equal than others. Life's been treating me very well, and I want to bless you. Pick a card from my deck, adventurer. Pick a card. Got crazy jump. It was a weird mix of art styles. I, I called it Discount Cuphead, and I stand by that. Or maybe off-brand Cuphead. Without warning, a strange cat leaps into your path and says in calming voice, My presence is a present. Now choose one of my paws. Gold. Oh. At the end of each turn, gain five absorb. Two defense or... Ow. Okay, so I was too, br I was too greedy. Let's go for the uh, thunder protection. Just the free defense might be better. What the heck is in the top left corner? It says I got an artifact. Don't mind if I do. Random. You know it. Ride that mystery machine. I don't even know other options. What the shit is that? I should not question. Out of nowhere, a banana boat appears. It's operated by an honest, wholesome being. He says, I'm that guy. Come on, hop on my boat, man. It'll be fun. Jump on the boat. Beg for money. Jump on the boat. I'm not sure if that was fun enough. Elite fight, we're doing this. Okay, sure. That is a good way to describe this game. Protection. Protection. A little Jimmy. I can't do anything else, I don't think. But that's fine. I got protection for days. Oh, he gets tougher, maybe. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. Protection, protection. And I'm gonna do power. And easy slash. I don't have enough juice. Okay, so he's starting to hurt more. Card to the left is an offensive card. Deal more damage. Huh. That's an interesting one. Oh, I'm fragile. Receive 50% more damage. That would do it. Boy, this guy got, uh, punchy. Yeah, does he just get progressively harder? No, it looks like he kind of capped out. Can I get another little Jimmy? I can, in fact. Okay, what's my power at? Eh. Uh... It looks like a summoner build is super viable, though. Ow. Why did I do that? That was not the card I was going for, but that's fine. Oh, right. I also have dice. I gotta remember those. Elite Protector, absorb 23 damage. Uh, deal 30 damage, gain 1 power consumed, or 18 damage added die. A real frenzy. Alright, let's take a look at this. So, Cutlass, 1 hand. 2 attack, 4 crit. I'm gonna go for the Greaves. And minimum dice is now roll is always rolled two or let's go with the old man's poop bucket. What a name! All right, I'm gonna go for another elite fight. Obviously, it hurts. Okay, I don't know what he's doing, so I'm gonna hit him. Who is that weird burrito man in the back? Okay. Rage. Okay, he's raged up. Well, it's little Jimmy. Uh, let's see. Probably real frenzy. And slash. I appreciate that I can summon multiple little Jimmys. They don't scale very well, but I can have a lot of them, which actually does scale well. Okay. Crazy jump. And then just defend. Now, how does defense factor into all of this? I figured it would increase the amount of, well, defense I have. Oh, and dice might be scaled on a per round basis. Interesting. Okay, let's do that and watch the dice. 
So do I get X number of dice per f per round? No. That's interesting. So I just get dice often, possibly all the time. Okay, hand cannon. 45 damage, apply fragile. If an enemy dies, draw another card. Yeah, so I get one die per round. Okay, I'm gonna grab the hand cannon. That sounds interesting. Uh... Yeah, what is... What does defense do? I guess I'm gonna do the Reaper Scythe. Okay. 5% crit or two attack. Go for the 5% crit. That could be useful, maybe. Which normal fight? Let's take a look at my equipment for a second. Oh, it would certainly help if I actually put this stuff on. Oh, no, I have it on? I do have it on. Okay, what does defense do? Maybe it just reduces all damage that I take. Anyway, witch? Witch. Let's see how the witch rolls. Hi, pick a card to sacrifice to obtain a random reward. All right. On that case, probably just get rid of a slash. Round wooden shield. Well, that's trash, but it's fine because I got rid of a card. A card that I didn't need. All right, garden boss battle. So, it's like a weird off-brand, oh boy. What? All right. It is what it is. What it is. All right, some little Jimmy. That's kind of a, a no-duh situation. I've got four. This one's tough. I guess crazy jump for the bonus damage and the crit, and we get a real frenzy. Boy, he's a tough sucker, and this is this one's gonna hurt. This one's really gonna hurt. All right, easy slash, protection, protection, shields up. It's not really much of a garden boss, to be honest here. Okay, he's gonna hit me for 25. Yeah, okay, let's do little Jimmy. I want a hand cannon. But I think it's better that we hit power. And have more little Jimmies out. Because ultimately, the more... Okay, you're new. Hi. Hit him with an easy slash. He's gonna hit me for... Is that 54? Yeah. Alright, let's do protection protection. I can block all the damage, but I'm gonna go for power. I'm hoping I heal after this. I just want to keep that power rolling so I can start wailing on him. Yeah, it didn't hurt that much. Alright. So next up, hand cannon. Crazy jump! And I don't have anything else to do. Aw, oh, fragile does not apply to... Ow. Slash, slash, little Jimmy, and then protection. All right, we got to play really safe because I am near death. I do have a lot of little Jimmies. What I probably should do, oh right, is use my damn dice. Okay, he's going to hit me for 60. Okay, I'm at 50. Now let's just let's just play slow, steady, and turtly. We got little Jimmy to save the day. If I just tank up hard, that just makes my life easier. Alternatively, we kill him. There we go. I'd say if you drop a dice on yourself, does it give you armor? Absolutely does. Ooh, armor of eight aegis. 
Okay, Sun Worshipper's Mask, yeah. Killing an enemy gives you mana, start combat with 5 power, max dice increase, nah. I'm mixed on these. This one's not that helpful. This one's kind of useful if I remember to do it. I'm gonna go for the anchor. Alright, into the dungeon. I appreciate the use of 3D for this one. Okay. Enchants? Ooh. Also, what is my HP? That's something I should check. Hi. No, it's a shop. Music is weird. Gain it absorb, deal 15 damage, add a copy of this card to the discard pile. Ah. Quick draw. Draw three cards, consume that. Summon Skittle Boy is good. The end of combat, restore HP. Start combat with absorb, attack plus two. Or just equipment. I'm gonna grab Skittle Boy. And then let's start removing cards. Now, not gonna lie, it's real tempting to just get rid of Slash. And Slash. Okay, and I can't I can't afford anything else even if I wanted to. Turtle become Master Roshi. Alright. This turtle boy is not going anywhere. Stop right there, young adventurer. My name is Frank. I'm a knight by profession. I must ask you a trick question. Answer right and I shall let you go in peace. Answer wrong and it's your life. So here goes. What's my favorite color? Pink. Also, I'm still very injured. My HP did not recover after the boss fight, which is bad. What's that, What's that awful rotten smell? Seems like I'm in a new area. There's no end to these doors, is there? All right, so not only that, but we got some friends. He's going to blow up. I don't know what that factors into, but it's spooky. I guess I'm going to start with that. We've got five power, which means I should probably start getting rid of the power cards. Okay. Well, he needs to die. And then let's armor up. Oh, I still have... Okay. Let's keep hitting him. Because we don't need power. And in fact, we should probably get rid of all the power cards that we've stacked up. Owie. Oh, that just gives me... All right. He dead. And then I get dice. Uh, let's probably just go for this guy. Hit him a bunch. Go from there. This looks goofy. It is. It's it's goof the spire. Okay, what's this? Adds to power. And that's gonna hit for 23. Well in that case, I can do I can do Skittle Boy. I'd like to do a little Jimmy, but we're gonna we're just gonna roll protection. Skittle Boy is just gonna keep me alive. Okay. Hit that guy. Armor of Aegis. I got two power. I've still got plenty of power. Let's just wail on that one. You cannot touch me. Skittle Boy will keep me alive. Thank you, Skittle Boy. Crazy jump. Slash. Protection. And slash. He dead? He dead. We're doing all right. Despite the fact that I'm near death's door. Well, anime girl's back. Level up! You're a big boy now, too. Oh, burning desire. Each hit this turn will deal an additional five damage. Double dash. Safeguard. I'm gonna grab Safeguard. That sounds interesting. Uh, I have Soros. I don't think any of these are that good. So we're just gonna skip them. How's this different from most roguelike deck builders? That's kind of what we're here to find out. Okay. Apply blind, don't care, but we do have that. 
Well, if neither of them are going to hit me, little Jimmy it is. Power up. Easy slash bomb boy. And then I'll just armor for reasons. Okay, we got to kill this guy. Okay, what do we got? I've got a hand cannon, but I think it's prepared. Oh, that's what blind does. Okay. Maybe you should have... Eh. I get enough defense. He dead. And this guy does nothing. Okay. Bloody Axe deals damage. No, no. He's going for the blind. But that's fine. Hand cannon. Bangage. And he dead. Hell yeah, power. Ooh. Gain 10 absorb. Get mana. Next round. I'll take that. Uh, let's grab the champion surcoat. Still don't know what defense exactly does. Like, I'd assume it affects my damage, but I haven't... Maybe defense is factored in... Oh, it is factored in before. It reduces their... Okay. Well, that's a lot of damage. Uh, let's see. Probably go for this guy, because he does the blind occasionally. This is tough, because I'd like to do crazy jump. But they're going to hit me for way too much. So we're just going to we're just going to go full tank. Okay, so I'm only getting hit once here. Protection, power, slash, cuz I get a I got to get rid of that blind. Luckily, we know exactly what my enemy is going to do. Oh, I actually took damage there. Dang. Oh, this puts me in a bad spot. Oh, maybe we'll be okay. Because he's upping his power. He's blinding me. He hit me, but we're fine. Really don't know what they're doing now, though. Okay, stone, stone skin. Switch those. I've got four mana. How much absorption? Not enough. I don't know what they're up to. I'd like to get another Skittle Boy, but yeah, they're all they're all swinging. Oh, oh, Jesus! Okay. All right, let's delete him. We get the armor of ages, but that doesn't help me too much. Do protection. Okay. Let's load that up. Five, ten. Oh. Oh, it's times two, of course. Okay, and I can't do anything else, so I'll just power up. All right. That was a lot of damage. Got the code for this today. 100% forgot it was coming out and that I was excited for it. I had no idea this was coming out. Oh, boy. It's weird. But that's pretty much true of every single game these guys have ever made. Okay, I've got 34. They're going to hit me for a lot. I guess let's do Skittle Boy and then Protection. That should give me just enough, yeah, so they can't hurt me. And we got a, we got a couple of Skittle Boys rolling now. All right. Easy slash. Let's go for blind boy. Doggo ain't ain't too spook. So I'm looking at 32. Now each skittle boy gives me six. Oh. My attack power is actually way high. I guess let's just do armor of Just load those up. Probably not squander it. So power scales a lot better than I thought it did. Which is good. 56 damage. Yeah, if I do that, 
I hit him. That gets my power up. Well, that I... J okay, he's gone. Bye. Everything is good. Okay, maybe we should have gotten the artifact that gives me mana on kill. I didn't think I'd be killing that much. Or, I'd have to. But here we're at. Okay. Get him with the hand cannon. And he's gone. Damn. Looks weird for sure. I... It's meme the spire. It's really weird. Removes all your buffs and debuffs. Seal uh, 5 to 25 gold from the enemy. Okay. Let's get the pants on. I'm just stacking defense like it's the only thing that will save me because that's exactly true. And I'm going to go probably kill myself by fighting this elite enemy, but if I can pull it off, I will be a happy camper. That's, uh, that's some damage. That's a little, a little rude. That said, skill boy. Defend self. Easy slash and power up. Okay, he's hitting me for a good 30 again. So we got protection. We got looter. And we got real frenzy. Yeah, my power bonus is up to 45%. I don't understand exactly how... Oh! Every time I use power, it scales up. And increases... Holy shit, that's nuts. Hit self and stun. Huh. Alright. I don't necessarily trust that, but... Uh, hand cannon? Okay. We have much else, so we'll just do juicy stone skin. None of these are that helpful. I'm just gonna. Uh, it's not gonna help me. Okay. Is he going to hit himself in the face? He is. He stunned himself. I don't. Stun cannot act this turn. Weird. But that's fine. Now, don't forget to equip your pants. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. All right, he's going to hit me for 33. But that's okay. Yeah, 75%. So that's exactly how this works. Okay. So I... I'm getting... I'm getting how this whole power business works. And holy shit, it's nuts. Okay, what is that? Spawn a suicide bomber. Oh. Let's roll that. Uh, it's Skittle Boy Power. I go for the little Jimmy, but now that I've now that I know how this all works, it's not actually as worthwhile. Okay. Ninety-five damage. Alternatively, Crazy Jump. Arm of Ages and Power. Nothing can touch me. Cute little shield gobos. They're adorable. I love them. Okay. So he's going to hit me for 36. We're going to power. We're going to safeguard. Okay. I have 10. Each one of these guys is 6. So that's 18 plus 5, 23. So if we summon another Skittle Boy, we don't take any damage. Free armor for days! What, you thought you'd be able to hurt me? Skittle says otherwise. Alright. You know what I also have? Eh, uh, screw it. Bam! Bam! Okay, maybe I should have gone for the Skittle Boy, but it's fine. Let's load that up. I'm gonna preemptively dice. I'm just gonna use the dice to fill up my defense if I need it. <laughs> Hell yeah, Skittle Boys. That was Safeguard. And Power again. And then I guess just Crazy Jump. Damn! Alright, we found a busted strat. I appreciate the changes they've made here. Wait, I took damage. Took damage. He dead. 
Copy paste babies. Hell yeah. All right. Add five dice. All six is consumed. No, I don't really like any of these. Nor these? Let's just go for the defense. I'm just... I'm just going to scale down their damage as much as possible so I can just live through everything. Okay, slightly less HP, but that's fine. Normal, normal, normal. Well, all right. I thought I was dead. I am not, and it's odd. Protection. Power, power, safeguard. Juicy stone skin. Let's see. Looter. Hand cannon. And I can't do anything, but that's okay. Okay, so he's going to hit me for... 28. If I do protection, Skittle Boy, slash, and then I'm just going to drop a quick die on myself, just for the sake of it. Well, that's a thing. Alright, now he's going to hit me for 32. I'm very afraid that we're going to run into an enemy that scales up. We're going to, and it is going to be spooky. Gain power. Juicy stone skin. And protection. The thing's face kind of reminds you of Eggman. Yeah, it's it's got a death egg face on it. Okay, power. Hand cannon. Uh, I guess crazy jump, just because. It dead. We good. So what's gold for? There are shops occasionally. We roll dice. Summon Auto Baron. Summon a helper that deals 50 damage every other turn. I love the idea of the guy, but no. He's kind of expensive anyway. And we're going to just skip those. Uh, do I go merchant? Yeah, I go merchant. I got a decent number of things. Wait. Why is that 10? Is that gold? Yeah, I'm gonna go for bandage. I should have bought bandage previously. I just assumed, I don't know. Oh, it's this guy again. I like this guy. Coins. An armor. Maybe I should have done little Jimmy, but I don't think I need it. Apply fragile heal player. That's different. Skittle boy, slash, tank up. He healed me for two. I see why. That said, he's only going to hit me for 36. Let's just be tank boy and keep just pumping that power. I, I love how my strategy here is just pump iron. Just pump iron endlessly. It's not a terrible strategy. Okay. Ooh. Let's say this one... This one's gonna hurt, but it's not. We'll be fine. 
power. Juicy stone skin. Hand cannon. Okay. So I've got 10 absorb. Let's fix that. This is going to hit me for 40. Now it's not going to hit me for any. I really like the dice system. It's a good way of mitigating minor damage there. Okay. He's hitting me for a 27. He could be. I'll hit him with a slash. I probably should have hand cannoned him. But I'll, I don't know. Okay, let's do real frenzy. Stone skin. I love the fact that this guy heals me. I really appreciate that. Oh, I don't actually have the bird's nest. That's okay. Oh yeah, keep healing me, boyo. You will regret it eventually, you'll just have no idea why. A crazy jump. Yeah, keep healing me. That... Oh. Uh, I don't know. Okay, summon a little... Summon a little... Chip. Oh, max summons reached. Oh. Okay, that is very good to know. Let's roll those. Hand cannon. And he did. So we only get to have four summons. So that means we actually want to sell little Jimmy. Or get rid of him in some way, shape, or form. Uh... I go for the prototype, but I really like having that defense. Let's go for the all-seeing eye. Start a combat, 20 damage to all enemies. Or, out. 20 absorb. Go for Icarus wing. We give me heal room. Please give heal. Oh, I'm hurt. Alright, let's take a look at these bad boys. So he is going to shuffle lame hand. Oh, no. Okay. So I think I need to care about this a little bit more. Punch it. Drunk junks. On the plus side... Uh, holy shit. Okay, they're going to do... an egregious amount of damage to me. Okay, so each one of them does 36 damage. Freaking. Wow. Okay, I might I might still be in trouble on this one. Y'all. I'm dead. Dang. I wish I... Had... I wish I healed after uh, boss fights. That would make my life a lot easier. Choose a card to keep in purgatory. I don't know what Purgatory does. Do I get to keep it? I hope so. That's the case, Skittle Boy? Okay, we got Crystals and EXP. So this might actually have a bit of a heavy meta progression. Almost all of their games do. There's a character customization for more faces. Well, this is my face. Oh, but we also have that face. Okay. So, new run. Aha! After my hard-fought battles, I discovered a place where I can use these magic crystals. Everything I purchased here will be with me at the start of my adventure. Okay, this is different. Broken mirror, reflect the next hit back at an enemy. Summon Hellraiser. Summon a helper that applies fragile to a random enemy who doesn't have fragile at the end of every turn. Summon candy. Summon a helper that gives one mana every three turns. Deal damage equal to your current gold. Interesting. Only got a couple of these, though. 
Adds new third... Oh, adds new third boss. Alternative, the Blind Colossus. Second boss, first boss. Every time you start a new run, you can pick your starting bonus by worshipping the ancient gods, or... Madame Baba Ganoush will offer you to increase the game's difficulty for before every new area. Also, character grower. Hey, that's not it. Although my body perished, my spirit advanced and gained EXP. I should use EXP to make me more powerful for future adventures. Merchant disco uh, discount. More gold. Offensive cards deal more damage. Defensive cards have more absorb. Starting attack, starting defense, starting HP. And crit. Well... All things considered, I'm just going to mostly invest in defense for now. Holy Water Throw. 30 damage to all. Next turn, draw three extra cards. Funny. I... I like these. The equipment is mostly garbage. The cards are kind of hit and miss. Gold Baron would be interesting if I had a lot of money. Otherwise, summon candy. But even then, I don't know. What if I can just hold on to these crystals for another run? Maybe I can. Fancy deck builder. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I want more. I want more Skittle Boy. Okay, let's lose one of those. That sounds... This looks like a good start to me. 